<laughs> Good morning, I'm Marla Ellerman and we're here at the Mobile Payment Conference in South Beach and I'm with Stacy Tappan and Ben Hurley from Apriva. Thanks for joining us. And they are gonna tell us about Apriva Pay Plus today. We released the original Apriva Pay about three years ago. And since then we've um, gone after you know our partner channels. We have 900 plus ISOs and financial institutions. We focused the last um, few years on the financial institutions. So right now we have two of the top five banks in the US have private labeled our Apriva Pay Plus application. Um, and we have about 15 banks in the US selling a branded version of our application. Um, we're getting ready to release 3.0, which Ben is going to talk about here shortly. We're really excited about that and we think it's really going to set us apart from a lot of the payment applications that are out there. Great, so tell us about the 3.0. Right, so the third generation app is coming out um, at the end of the first quarter of this year. Um, essentially it is, well it's, it's a massive step for us. So <clears throat> we're coming out with localization, the ability to offer the, the mobile client and the supplementary services, the documentation, email in any language that you need. Um, we'll be starting out with uh, Spanish and French but then targeting other in, uh, you know markets. Um, the idea is, is to give us the capability to expand internationally. And then uh, on top of that we're coming out <clears throat> with a web companion, a, uh, a merchant portal web application that allows for centralized business management of things like inventory, users, reporting, um, you know, more uh, business-centric tools. So th there's certain types of functionality you can put in a mobile client, but we're really focusing on the, the web companion for larger companies than, than mobile sort of micro-merchants. So why did you guys pick the banking and financial market to get, roll this out in? Well, I think there's there was an opportunity. At first, I think there was a defensive move on their part, you know, with the likes of Square garnering all the attention on mobile payments and applications when there were actually several of us out there first um, at the same time. So we thought it would be a good idea to offer a white label solution so these financial institutions can go after their existing customers to create stickiness and we found out that was indeed the case. Um, and you know the brand is important. You, we're, we're leveraging their brand and we've always been behind the scenes at Apriva and why not leverage a national bank name um, when you think about taking payments you know my mom might take uh, a payment from a, a bank name versus somebody like a square which she's never heard of so you know that was kind of our pitch out there saying leverage the brand that you have we'll white label it um, and so it can be your brand in the front from a payment aspect since you're going after the financial institutions are you doing this with direct sales or are you doing this through some of your partners and your ISOs we uh, we nev we not a merchant acquire we don't go after the the guys directly we leverage our current channels so we have a lot of partners that have um, banking channel partners um, we have had some financial institutions institutions approach us directly, um, but again, we're not a merchant acquirer, so we'll provide the software application. They stay with their existing processor as status quo, and we just basically brand the app for them, and those transactions come through the Apriva gateway, and we also provide level one support for their merchants. Right. That's great. So there was a lot of talk today and yesterday about social media. Would, mm -hmm. this, would this be something that you'll send out on social media, or is it too high level? Um, in terms of marketing the product or integrating with social media? Well, uh, probably marketing the product first, and but once it's out, out there integrating with social media. So we, we have plans for location-based uh, social media integration for merchants. Um, I, I can't provide too much information on what that means, but for people that understand check-in and proximity, um, we, we definitely have plans for those types of integrations. Okay, great. Yeah. Well, and for more information, you can contact Apriva directly and see them at some of the upcoming shows. Thanks for watching. Thank you.